Well, down in the uh, Exeter City Council solar farm, this has been built to charge our electric fleet. We will be powering our own vehicles. We will guarantee that our electric vehicles going around Exeter are running on green electricity. And that's really important to us. We've got a lot of electric uh, trucks and cars that the city runs. All of those need to be charged and we want to ensure they're charged on green energy. This is an amazing site. Um, there's 3,700 solar panels um, and that generates direct. That will charge our vehicles, but we need to have sustainable, constant charge, both to run our electric vehicles that collect the, the waste and the recycling, but also the vans and the cars we drive around. It's got to be a constant charge. 3,700 um, solar panels and one megawatt battery and that's what's unique about this site. This should go live um, next month in September um, and uh, it's, there's still some elements of work to be done. Um, there's a private charge cable because this is purely for charging the, the City Council's electric fleet. So the, the linkage is direct. We're not uh, adding the load to the national grid here. One of the problems with generating green energy is the capacity of the grid. There's a limit to what the grid can handle. So if we're generating it here and using it here, it makes sense to run direct. This is a definitely a large step towards being carbon neutral by 2030. The important thing is to cut down our emissions. That has to happen across the whole city. What we are in control of as a city council is what we generate. Of course, we want to lead and support and encourage the partners and the residents of Exeter to cut down on their emissions. But what we really have control of is what we do as a council. This is a prime example of what we are doing to cut down on our emissions. The, the amount of diesel and emissions made from our commercial vehicles who are out collecting the rubbish, collecting the recycling, that's a lot of emissions and we are going to cut them down, we are going to remove them. We're going to have electric um, trucks collecting your, your rubbish and your recycling, big trucks, and this will power them. Taking on um, the climate change portfolio is, it has been an incredible learning experience for me. I thought I knew about environmental issues. Wow, I've got a lot to learn. But what's really great is stepping into this role, seeing the work that the team has already done to make the City Council um, net zero by 2030. An awful lot of work has been done in all sorts of areas. This solar farm is a significant step forward in terms of energy independence, not drawing power from the grid, generating it locally, generating it in a sustainable green way and using it to reduce our emissions as a council.